Well, in 2019, when I launched ProSense, um, and it became its own entity, you know, registered with the state, having its own tax ID number, um, it started out as a buying group. Um, and then it's made a slight pivot. And then even earlier this year, we even changed from being a buying group because I listened to those that I was serving. Um, and they said, hey, we like what you're doing, but we're having a hard time with the the, the fee structures that we had in place. But to be able to grow, I was like, are they criticizing me or the product? No, they're criticizing in a way that allows me to expand outside because I was honestly creating a, a wall around what I was doing, but in doing it as an event and creating a space where I'm looking to br build bridges between silos, it allows me to reach more people and create more value for more people throughout the environment of, that I serve. Um, so some people would have taken that and said, oh, well, you know, woe is me. But, you know, it was hard to hear. But I look at it now and I go, this is probably one of the best decisions I've made. And there might be another iteration to come about. But um, I don't look at it as, as a stumbling block. I look at it as a stepping stone.